Dan Penn and Spoon Rolled them a great song by this written for Aretha Franklin. Um, they were members of the Stax, you know, band, you know, played with Booker T. But Dan came into the studio. Kevin knew Dan and I'd worked with him some other things. And Dan was like, he came into the studio and he was such a cool character. He um, he walked in and he wears like dungarees like a farmer and has a piece of toothpick in his mouth all the time. And just came in and it was just like such a great soul person. And he does, he, apparently these were his good overalls. He has overalls for around the farm and overalls for going out. And these were his good overalls. Um, they've written, you know, these, these two guys have written so many great songs together. And we recorded this, we had Steve Cropper playing guitar. Uh, you know, it was just, uh, it was like one of the great moments. You know, this song was cut by Edda James. You know, I've known this song by, you know, loads of different people singing it. But it's a, a song I really want to sing because of Dan Penn. Uh, so we finished recording this song and we said, oh, thanks very much for coming in, Dan. It was such a pleasure to do one of your songs while you're here, you know. Uh, and then we, Kevin said, okay, we better keep working. Why don't we do on, move on to this song? Uh, sorry, why don't you move on to this song? And uh, Dan sat there quietly with his overalls and he said, you should... I wrote this one too. <laughs> I thought you go, oh, really? I didn't know that. And this happened, you know, and then we finished the next song. I'll tell you about it as we get to it. We finished the next song, and I said, okay, that's really great. We're in a third song for the day, you know. He's still sitting in the corner with his drink, you know, and his toothpick. And we said, oh, we're going to, let's cut this song next. There you go. I co wrote this one. <laughs> so this guy has written everything. He's one of the great songwriters. Um, Steve Cropper plays guitar on this and does a great solo. Steve, um, you know, like everybody knows Steve. We played with the Blues Brothers, played with Booker T. Steve was one of the is one of the great guitar players of all time. He invented the chink, chink. That's, he, that's a Steve Cropper. When you're recording, you say play a Steve Cropper. That's what it is. Um, I, I've been a fan of Steve's forever. I've I've actually met Steve quite a few times when he's been out here on tour uh, over the last 30 years, and. We always wanted to get together and do some work. You know, it was always, we'd talk and we'd say, he'd heard my records and I'd you know, obviously heard his and we'd end up sitting in the bar or something talking. Um, I actually, I got to sing with Steve one night uh, at the uh, at the State Theatre when he was out here with someone else, with, uh, with Guy Sebastian actually. Uh, and, I, and I said, oh look, I still haven't got you to play on my record. When I got round to doing this record, Steve was in Nashville, and this was the first time, we, although we'd spoke about it for 30 years, we got together and Steve plays on I Worship the Grand Walker. Believing, a baby, can't you see? 